Hello beautiful souls, hi explorers. Welcome or welcome back to the mystic maze to see what's happening in your mystical journey for today. I've been preparing the three cards. I mean, those are like postcards or stationery, okay? And represent the three choices for today. So feel free to connect the higher self and also with your intuition, because hopefully there will be a message for you um the question is about your bff your best friend so it's like the bestie but uh, remember that we're not speaking only about some kind of bonds also we can speak about blood so maybe he's a brother maybe he's what you consider a sister so he's a special person and i think that like, you know who we are talking about so keep concentrate on that and let you be called by these postcards and take only the thing that are resonating as this is general so this is for pile and maze number one very flourish and delicate this one this one is also it's very woody okay for maze and pile number two And we do also have these postcards for maze and pie number three. So feel free to pause the video, take your time, find your peaceful corner in order to enjoy and connect better and be called by the cards and images or even the slightest detail can make the difference. So feel free to do that. Maybe there is a message, hopefully, and if it is resonating, yes, you are in the right place, okay? As this is general, so whenever you are ready to go and to enter your maze, your labyrinth, whether you're explorer, click the button in the timestamps right there below, and you will find me in your maze. I see you there. Hello, dear explorer. This is the postcard you picked with birds and flowers. So I'm really eager to see what's going on, what's happening. I hope you see everything. And I will start by making two, I will make two lines. One is what you, uh, they think of you on a more superficial shallow point of view and then we have another one for more much more deeper um, sensation thoughts and feelings okay we have self-love oh, very beautiful so this way you will be able to understand if we are resonating this is more shallow energies we have divine connection We do also have grief, it's like accepting loss. We do also have this beautiful um, wind of changes. Let me move it this way. And then we have motivation for a clock. I'm feeling like my dear explorer that person you have in mind in here is on a more um, unconscious level is seeing you as someone who is very self-sufficient, very abundant, very able to take care of you and they find you very attractive for that. So I feel like you are like a, a pillar for them to support them, to give them directions, to be there and to be a, such a beautiful example for them. They also feel like some sort of divine connection with you, with the things that are resonating. Maybe you have a lot of similarity. You can be a lot on the same page. And I'm feeling like they really like the way your energy are working out on situation because I'm feeling like you can be trusted. And with this divine connection, I'm feeling like they are in your team and feel like they consider you in the A team and you're like very much accepted by their side and I feel like they have some sort of feel rouge with you and is based on self-love so also this is reflecting the energies of the other person maybe and it could be sometimes it makes a mixture of the energies and they perceive 
both of you, them and you very abundant with feelings and things that you can, you know, offer because love is what we need, you know. And I perceive that you are, you sound to them very abundant. I'm feeling like also um, with the three final cards, they perceive you very on a more shallow uh, level griefing because you had maybe in the past you have been under many treats proofs uh tests of life so you might have been suffered a lot for some of you very specifically you can have been blocking yourself in accepting some loss some refusal of life okay and they perceive that you have this kind of void at the beginning of something something like not accepting um grief or just yes loss something that you maybe your emotional part or maybe we are speaking about on a mystical trip um, also about the ego is like you were refusing something because you were refused so you were locked out okay from a situation and they perceive that you were very sad for that but i'm also perceiving that they see you very strongly and highly motivated because we have motivation in here and it's shown very near to this wind of changes that is coming so they see you making a lot of efforts to reach the things you want in your mystical journey and i'm feeling like they see you very super motivated it's like you tell yourself the right things you are having your focus on the right path on the right details and i feel like you're following through and they really perceive you by the way, this dragon is looking at divine connection and self-love, so it's kind of in the middle of it. So they see you that you are changing, but maybe you are not really understanding that of yourself. You do not recognize the beautiful, you know, victories that you have in your life. And maybe they are perceiving that sometimes you are too connected with the past regarding this grief. But I'm feeling like you are really willing to, to go on in, in that, okay? So let's see what's, what's more. We do have the moon. We do have pleasure. This is like Belle de Nuit, you know? This is a flower that's blossoming only at night at a certain point and moment. And we do have the nighttime and the moon in here. So this is like much more deep introspection energies that you bring on to them. And I'm feeling like this is very rare. This is very specific. They see you as very special. We do have heart healing. Very beautiful. We do also have legacy, persistence. And we do also have the path, so a portal, this opening, you know, and there is this stair bringing you to somewhere else and uh, very beautiful. So as a deep uh, meaning for, for, for them about what they perceive of you is like you are intriguing. You are such a beautiful, also in the look, I'm feeling like they, they perceive you as very uh, good looking and very sophisticated, very feminine energies are coming to me. I'm feeling like you're very romantic as well. And also you can be a person that reflects a lot, my dear explorer. So I feel like also that you love pleasure and this is like very luxurious. This is like very sensual. I feel like you are able to take care a lot of yourself. And I feel like they, they see the details that you bring on with your look, with your outfits, with the, the I don't know, the nails, the shoes, the, the little feminine details that even though you can be a male, it's not important because the energies are free, you know, free of gender. and. They're just bringing you energies of sophistication regarding your look and the way you seduce people. So you're very sensual for them. You're very hot for them. 
and it's like they're they're seeing you you put a spell on other people because you you can be able to mesmerize people with all the abundance and all the focus that you have in life so i feel like also you can be seen as a determined person very determined i'm picking like the energies of someone so what they think about you what the bff or sister or brother you know we're speaking about blood or it could be other kind of bonds you know and this relationship is based on them seeing you healing and bringing some new things on your way i'm feeling like they 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 perceive that you are building some sort of legacy okay because you're persistent you want to go on your way and this dragon is looking at this healing and the other beautiful characteristic that you have and that they perceive regarding you and i'm picking like you bring on your stuff you so you're very determined to um, do your things and i'm feeling like you want something new and they perceive it and right now is the occasion the timing you're seeing this reading is like you are building your future you are going on with your stuff you're centering much more than in the past and right now you're really able to see that those beautiful energies uh, inside of you are just going to a place of new occasion under some kind of reflections also this could be a mirror so i feel like you're really based on reflection introspection seeing the self being connected with the higher self with the highest motivation that you can have in life and also feel like this is a sort of planning so also masculine energy is coming in so you believe in magic and they perceive that you like to see the moon to see the star to see the beautiful things i feel like you're also very connected with the night time i don't know why but i do have this sensation so maybe you are more productive or prolific with this kind of um discovery you're making on yourself so also um the planning that you're making in your life and i feel like they really perceive that i want uh one major arcana for you when you're exposed so what does your bff sister or brother thinking of you i want a major arcana and then i want it eyes okay this one wow again the moon and then we do have the tower so the, yes building new things under the influence of the moon so very romantic very feminine very of self-discovery self you know you're doing your things and you're doing it very profoundly you are very profound you have super profound, you're super spiritual, super mystical. And I feel like they, that's the things that they find most fascinating about you. And you bring it on, you are building your future and they, they are okay staying by your side because you are on the same page. And this is so beautiful. I want to dice for you. This one, wow. Okay, I'll let you see. This is a clock, so I'm feeling like this is the right timing for you or this is the right timing to get closer to them. Maybe they can help you out. Maybe they can be very supportive. But I'm feeling like the right timing is coming for you and they perceive you very beautifully equipped on this journey of mystical discover, rediscovery, you know, shuffling your cards on the table and planning something beautiful in order to enter this portal and finally with your motivation with a lot of changes and challenges you will be um, passed by these heavy energies that you had and keeping the best part of you that is very owlish you know is like the howl very nighttime very reflection i feel like you can be a writer you can they, maybe they know that you write poetry or you have a, a secret diary or something like that i don't know if you compose you you know a composer of music of artistical taste i'm feeling like you you at night time do your best and that's the best um timing they want to see and exchange energies very esoteric as well but i'm feeling like mostly is based on the pleasure to do things very artistical very you know sophisticated and complex for 
most of the people but i'm feeling like they see us very beautiful beautiful creature and they really want to stay and interact with you even though they see you that right now you are you know losing all the illusions and you're letting go something very important because this is the right timing and that's what they see perceive and think of you my dear explorer i hope that this is resonating if you want to exchange with an action you know in, in an active way some energies to respond to the reading you can click a lot of buttons comment like share it's really up to you and if you want to keep updated you know what to click and there is also a bell okay so thank you very much i wish you the very best with your bff sister and brothers and i hope that you enjoy stay free of mind and of art i wish you the best in your journey see you soon hello beautiful beautiful explorer this is the card you pick i mean the postcard this is the maze represented in here to see the thread regarding your bff your sister, maybe a brother, maybe someone regarding blood, but also a special person that, and that I'm feeling like you know what we are speaking about. I put this in here. This is like very voodish, so I'm feeling like you can be very earth connected with this person. Maybe this person is grounded, I don't know, but I'm picking like I want to see two lines. The first one will be, the first one will be for a more, um, shallow interaction and uh, thoughts they have regarding you and the second one would be more profound more spiritual okay more inner energies shown we have darkness wow what i see about you what they perceive <laughs> it's very deep we have self-acceptance this is like the strength card it's very interesting by the way we have culmination, completion, and renewal. Well, yes, this one. We do have the mountain. Very resonating. Very resonating. And we do also have intimacy. This is like evening star. So. My dear explorer, I'm feeling like this person is seeing you very, very profoundly. So even at first glance, the connection that you have with this person is very much, much deeper than usual. I'm feeling like they see you, they perceive you. They are, yes, sharing many thoughts and many, you know, internal ideas or feelings or deep things that are happening with the higher self for both of you so i'm very happy for that because the energies that are coming to me is like they see you starting from a very doomy place where you were really able to see to taste some kind of bittersweet experience in your life and that was the occasion for you to come to self-acceptance you see the passages are very beautiful this person is really centering is really focusing on you and is perceiving a lot of things such as the darkness the void the lack of light and enlightenment that you had in your life because it was a doomy place doomy situations and problems so i feel like they they see you striving uh, struggling against some problematic in life many bad events maybe in your past and they perceive you with self-acceptance so rediscovering of the treasures that you have with all those candles, all those golden stone on the, you know, near the sea, near a river. I'm feeling like they really like the work that you make on yourself. And I'm feeling like they are very proud of that because they see you coming at to this point of culmination where you are renewing your energies, when you are offering something much deeper, stronger, better brighter you know it's like this is like empowering card i let you see because this lady is so fascinating for me it's very sexy and sensual as well and this is speaking of self-empowering this is about leadership you lead the, on your throne in your own kingdom that is very internal okay also i feel like you were under such a very deep and intense path 
regarding the mystical side of your journey and i'm feeling like right now you are at the top of your mountain this is like top quality and top notch you know i feel like you are some sort of perfectionist they see you very you know very picky very choosy also in a very kind of sweet way yeah so that's what i perceive they, they really admire you i'm feeling like and they perceive that you are getting stronger and stronger in your mystical journey because you were not stopped and blocked by the darknesses the doomy places all the tests all the events that were trying to stop you and you were you know, unstoppable, do you want to reach the top of the mountain? This is also speaking about a very deep connection with very specific places. I don't know if something is resonating with you specifically, but yes, you can be, you know, you can be in love with trekking. You can love high, high places, you know, where to see, where to have the best view of things. I feel like also this is speaking of solitude because at the top of the mountain, there is no space for many people. And so I feel like you're really able to select the things you want in life. That's why I consider that the quality, the top quality card. And also they see the intimacy. So I feel like you're very close with this person, but I want to go on if it is resonating with you when you're exploring. This is so interesting. <laughs> we do have engineering for the deepest uh, energies they perceive about you wow awareness moon flower vine wow very deep we do also have change something has changed very deeply they perceive that they see you they feel you we have responsibility. This is going to be so profound because I mean, I'm feeling like they, they grab your journey, your true self. And we do also have time as special resource to take care of with this dragon because it has a different color. You see, this is like green and this was uh, brown. It has different meaning and sense. Okay, my dear explorer, pile number two. So I'm feeling like your friend, your BFF, your bestie, your brother, your sister, this special person is perceiving of you. You are planning. You are, this is like for me, mindset, okay? So empowering, culmination. I'm feeling like you're sophisticated, the, the, the tools that you have in your mind and in your life. You are taking control. It's like the chariot energies that are coming to me and also the magician. And also uh, it's like you're trying to manifest things, new things, and you're really willing you are on the verge of these beautiful changes because i'm feeling like the change is one is big but it's also at many different you know uh, nuances during this path i'm feeling like the first step is you trying to set the, the best uh, mindset on things to plan things to conquer your own kingdom and territory because you want to be a king be a queen and this is so beautiful so empowering i'm feeling like awareness is very important for you it's like you are opening your eyes more and more because you made this self-acceptance and i'm feeling like by by making this self-acceptance the, the step prior to that is like self self view on the self so it's like you were really able to listen to your higher self to connect with the most innerish part of your soul and this way you were you were really able to take care of you to see you the way you are and that's that awareness is really like the icing on the cake that makes a lot of difference so i feel like also with awareness and with responsibility culmination and this beautiful card i'm feeling like also the image that is coming to me is like a um the one near the sea, the lighthouse, you see, you know, um, the image is like you have your lighthouse right now and you're able to detect the things you want to, 
you are right now enlightening yourself and this is like super beautiful and this person is perceiving that of you is seeing you is there for you very supportive energies you are under many changes for sure because you are shifting the energies and you're taking responsibility for the wrong that you have done also for the one that you've been receiving because i feel like right now you are more connected with your energies and you are able to take responsibility while in the darkness place of the beginning of your journey you were not really able to do that and to set proper boundary i mean healthy boundaries regarding taking your part of responsibility and things and maybe you were you were someone who as past energy were trying to you know put the the litter on other people you know if you know what i mean but right now you're not pointing the finger outside you're making such a beautiful and interesting journey on on this earth and i feel like time is the special resource is the key that brought you to darkness to responsibility and to this kind of planning new mindset new perception i feel like you're very intuitive and moreover you're very analytical because you were courageous and bold to see yourself to accept yourself and that's what's brought you a lot of shifting in the energies a lot of shifts in the energies um making happen the great change that is you being in charge of yourself and this person is so proud of you it, it's coming to me so this is like very beautiful right now this is like wood so you're very pragmatical right now very productive very i feel like you're the manager the boss of yourself and this person is perceiving that and it's so so beautiful i want to major arcana to see the way they perceive you my dear explorer your best friend it could be also boyfriend girlfriend you know uh okay we have the magician so right now they see you manifesting things and this is so beautiful this is super beautiful i hope you see all the cards because i got the impression that you were not okay so this is like the magician and you are manifesting everything in your glorious glorious way right now and we do also have temperance at the back of this deck representing the path the mystical path that you are making right now because there is a lot of healing a lot of empowerment i want to dice for you and explore also how do you perceive me <laughs> okay this is a sandwich i don't know if you know many things about communication but uh, there is a sandwich technique to be morbid than crispy with the content and in the end morbid, morbid again soft with the things we say to let people understand them in a more lovable way and I'm feeling like they see you doing this so nurturing yourself with very interesting interesting words like a lot of affirmation they see the work that you have done with yourself they have a lot of you know they perceive you they see you they are there by your side and they are very supportive and they trust you and they are seeing you healing and this is like the best conquer the best victory to share with the this bff with this special person and they really love you and they really care and they are seeing you changing a lot and they are still loving you because i'm feeling like you are nurturing okay this is like nurturing the mind the body and soul in this mystical journey and i'm feeling like they're very satisfied and proud of having you by their side so this is all for now my dear friend and explorer I mean, this was general, but if something is resonating, please take it and leave out the rest. This was very intense and beautiful and so sweet. And I feel like your personality, my dear explorer, is so strong and so, I mean, balancing. I see a lot of balance in here and, and nurturing, you know. 
of the self and time is the special resource for you so i hope you enjoyed take only the things that are useful for you to open your heart to open your mind you know to be more aware and if you want to be active in this process you can communicate you can exchange energy there are many many options and buttons you know the way better than me if you want to keep updated you know what to do there is a bell also i thank you very much and i wish you the very best of luck with your bff and your mystical journey so see you very soon hello beautiful soul this is the postcard very this is like mandala i don't know if it is the proper mandala but this flower is so specific and very beautiful i see yes uh, very fascinating for me a lot of details i will keep it in here i will make the reading for you regarding your person we have one row uh, one line sorry yes for the more superficial energies that this person is perceiving, your BFF, your sister, brother, you know, is not about blood, is about bond, okay? And then we have another line for more innerish thoughts and sensation regarding you, okay? Let's start from the beginning. We have sovereignty. Wow, this is deep. We do also have heal thyself. We do also have challenge standing up for your rights. This is going to be, I mean, for the moment, this is going to be very intense, I tell you. This one. We have the shoes, okay? This is a change, again, challenge, change, serenity, very intense, very specific. So take only the things that are resonating with your explorer. This is for that. We have challenge again, okay? Challenge, challenge. Wow, this is intense. And there was another card, but this one is for the final because it jumped out uh five so five sorry two no three <laughs> mathematic is not my best um skill so i feel like this person i feel like you're so empowering of the self in this moment of seeing this video i feel like you're like the queen or the emperor of something you have a, your own kingdom and I feel like your energies are very strong. A lot of changes are coming to me. They perceive you as very, very rapidly, very fast, going on another lane, on another path. I feel like you are building something important in here. It's like, I mean, the perception that I have from the view of this person is like your BFF is seeing you, is like on a throne. <laughs> It's like you being able to have the command on situation, on the self, also in life. Very conscious, very aware of the self, very aware also how the world works. Because I feel like healing yourself is super delicate and is like the basic energies connecting you with yourself and allowing you to bring on this beautiful healing and empowerment i'm feeling like we are speaking about natural natural leadership in here very emotional i'm getting very emotional a lot of energies of fire are coming to me i'm feeling like hair signs and also fire signs are coming to me and the mixture of the two is like mentality mind field and also you know it's like fire wands it's like actions ambition i'm feeling like you are the person i mean of the three piles my dear explorer that brings a lot of energy realistic pragmatically super intense you love new challenges you are standing up it's like you're having your battle you're having your opportunity and also the occasion you know to struggle to conquer to have your own victory like the six of wands 
and I'm picking like those shoes are drying, okay? Are not crying, are drying. So this is like a change card again. We had two change cards. This is like the beacon fruit. It's a fruit, you know, in the name. So we have during nighttime this transformation. You're like, I'm, I'm just joking, but during this mystical journey, it's like you're a bad man. You see also the dragon is resonating with the, I let you see, with the bath figure, you know, you have some sort of, uh, some sort of resemblance in here and also in the green. I feel like green and, and fire, you know, you are someone who is, is flying on the top of situations, you know, like the bath. And you can also, for me, this is the bath, represent for me also the end man you know because it can reverse the perception and the point of view and this is like very connected with intuition so i feel like you're a very challenging personality very strong of fire very determined i feel like you're very able to see yourself and to understand in this mystical journey your own energies and resources and also beautiful characteristics because I'm feeling like you're very proud of yourself and they perceive that you can be sometimes too dominant. <laughs> I don't know the role that you have with the other person, but I feel like you're very dominant, you know, it's like too fiery sometimes, too strong sometimes. But I'm feeling like they really like you and they see you as an example to follow. So let's go on with this reading. We do have the letter. I mean, this is not a letter. This is the envelope, by the way. Those are the more, most innerish view they have of yourself, of you, you know. Yes, let's do that. Intention. This is like Chinese star jasmine. Very beautiful. We do also have the void. inspiration and last but not least we have resilience finding your limits yes it's all about that with you my dear explorer i'm feeling like you have a lot of energies a lot of struggle a lot of secrets this is like communication i feel like you have a privileged uh, channel with yourself and also you have a privileged channel with them so a lot of mystery a lot un untold a lot a lot of secrets but because i feel like you're a very private person you keep everything for yourself i feel like with this intention and inspirations many eyes are coming in here and it's for unlocking unblocking many situations it's like you are in the void for those challenges but i'm feeling like in the void that's the best place for you the most mysterious place of the self of the imagination of where you can find your inspiration the images you desire the things that are resonating and that are calling you made for you there it's like dreaming and feel like you're very dreamy and being so profound is perceived by this person because i mean he or she really like you the way you are so you are a digger in life you are a researcher of life of setting and putting new boundaries finding your limits and this beautiful void resembling this challenge is like this could be your challenge okay to accept the void to stay there in order to bring out to abstract the nutrient you desire and also intention so focus you know the quality of your thoughts and also inspiration so creativity this is like the phoenix in this challenge because i'm feeling like the healing for you and the changing of the energies the most empowering part is your is not the proper challenge the proper challenge is understanding when you have no power when you standing in the void so the contrary of this sovereignty you know when you feel enslaved and by yourself that is the place you don't want to stay but this is also the place that it makes you rich richer and richer of soul 
from the mystical point of view and it's keeping you moving moving to um, the resilience you need to finding your limit to set your boundaries you see those tools are freeing themselves setting new boundaries more um, healthier healthier boundaries and discovering that the sky is the limit it's very profound i would like to see one major arcana for you because this is very beautiful for me we have justice so yes karmic event natural laws and also the stars so you connecting with other bringing light in this void because you are ready right now to accept the challenge to accept the void as a form of inspiration of self dialogue you know of self nourishing of the soul in this journey and i feel like you're really balancing cleaning the energies you have a lot of dilemmas a lot of challenges a lot of changes as well but with the star you have your own guidance and i'm so proud of that they see you growing and going on with your path with your beautiful lifestyle mindset and even though we have many secret places to discover or to heal okay or to stay in i'm feeling like you are very connected with this person and this person is really you are like the star for them so uh, some sort of guidance as well very deep connection i want one dice for you maybe explore it this one okay this is like a caravan and i'm picking like this person is really a caravan for me is a home is like the turtle you know and also is like moving because it has wheels so they want to they, they consider you home they see you as home and very very close very close relationship this person your bff i don't know we're speaking about sister brother cousin you pick the person and maybe you can let me know in the comment if it is resonating and who is this person i feel like they want to move and travel with you but on a solid basis because i feel like you're some sort of guidance my cat is coming in and yes my love are you bringing some energies to us dudu is saying hi very beautiful very this is like a returning uh, on uh, the origin where all the dilemmas will be resolved and this is like law of attraction law of something very higher and deeper and for the best to bring you clarity to bring you guidance and the two of you are very connected you know, like siblings i feel but this is very specific for some of you it's like you are twins uh, i mean it's not twin flames for some of you could be but also yes some sort of similarity between you and this person because they they perceive as very incommendable things and they are on the same page wow shadow treasures i told you many discoveries along the way shadow because we have this secret secret message okay in the envelope and also the void so is the most secret um place on earth regarding yourself my my love what the hell are you doing don't <laughs> just wait a second okay and uh, this shadow treasure is very important because i'm feeling like there are a lot to discover yet a lot of undiscovered things and secret and this is like a special card that happens so they see that you have a lot of mysteries and resources again and treasures okay so they really perceive you very very rich with mindset with inner qualities and um, okay so this is the time do 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 you want to say hi me and dudu are saying hi do do just say hi thank you for watching and stay with us okay she's a special guest for today the, this was very interesting and intense and empowering and she came out of nothing my love hope you enjoy it and that you like it thank you very much for watching us again if you want to exchange in a more active way you know all the buttons in here if you want to keep updated you can also click some bells you know thank you again take only the things that are resonating i wish you the very best but this person is really on the same page and you are something like 
soul companion in this mystical journey. So the best of luck. I hope to see you in the next maze. Bye. Do you want to say hi? Huh. <laughs> Bye.